relation between real depth and apparent depth when viewed from rarer medium here this medium is denser and this medium is rarer and uh, someone is viewing the bottom of uh, 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 object bottom uh, object on the bottom and uh, this is the refractive index of this medium is mu1 and this medium is mu2 and uh, mu1 is less than mu2 that is mu2 is denser and mu1 is rarer for example this is example consider this is a tank filled of water and uh, there is a object o and uh, any person is viewing this object o then what will he look on the object o how the object will appear to him we will discuss here this one when viewed from rarer medium that is from air or this is the denser medium like uh, water in the tank or while in the tank etc from the surface at uh, pq at this surface and at this point applying snell's law this is uh, this is the angle of incidence and this is the angle of refraction because uh, light is going like this so mu t sin i equals to mu 1 sin r now for very smaller i and r if uh, i and r is very small angle then uh, we can use the optics approximation that is mu t i equals to mu mu 1 r or mu t tan i equals to mu 1 tan r Or mu two into tan i, tan i will be tan i. That is this is this length that is equal to this length that is pq, and by and uh, this length uh, that is oq. So we have written here oq. Mu two into pq by oq q is to mu one tan r. This is the angle of uh, this is r. This whole angle is R, so this will be 90 minus R, so this will be R. So tan R will be this length divided by this length. So PQ divided by O dash Q. Or from this equation, we can write mu 2 by mu 1 equals to PQ, PQ will cancel. And so we have O Q by Q uh, O dash Q, and uh, this implies O Q is uh, O Q is the real depth, and uh, O Q dash is the apparent depth. Uh, o Q is the real depth of object O, and Q uh, uh, O dash Q is the apparent depth of object Q. So we can write d apparent by d actual. Uh, this is the uh, 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 reversing. So d apparent by d actual will be mu1 by mu2. Now when mu2 equals to mu and mu1 is equal to 1, for example, mu2 is uh, water and this is uh, air. So we can write d apparent by d actual equals to 1 by mu or d apparent equals to d real by mu. So this is the relation for the apparent depth of an object placed inside a, any uh, denser medium and viewing from the rarer medium. Now if there are several media now for several media net apparent distance is given by d apparent equals to sigma i equals to n d real by i divided by mu i or or d apparent equals to d1 by mu1 plus d2 by mu2 plus dash 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 d1 by mu1. Now the value of apparent shift in the position of object is given by apparent shift equal to oq dash 
or o q minus t dash uh, o dash into q that is equals to d l minus d l by mu or d l into 1 minus 1 by mu so the shift due to several media apparent shift will be sigma i equals to n d i g l into under bracket 1 minus 1 by mu or that is apparent shift equals to d1 into under bracket 1 minus 1 by mu 1 plus d2 into 1 minus uh, 1 by mu 2 plus dash 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 second case when viewed from the denser medium that is object in the rarer medium and viewing the object from denser medium this is the situation here shown uh, uh, this is our object this is our object and uh, uh, if this is considered this medium is here and this is the water and we are viewing from the water now here we have taken mu1 as a first medium as a, because we are our eye is in a, this medium so we have taken it as a mu1 and second medium as a mu2 and, and now in this case mu1 is greater than mu2 so ray is coming from uh, this and it, uh, into, uh, this is the real ob object here and ray is coming like this but due to going from denser to rarer medium it bends over the uh, normal so ray goes uh, like this reaches to i at uh, this point and uh, uh, the i uh, realize that uh, ray is coming from o dash so the uh, the uh, the person will see the object at this place now we can use again sign law to solve this problem again we have mu2 sin i that is second medium mu2 sin i equal to mu2 sin r mu1 sin r and now for, for a small angle we can write mu2 tan i equals to mu1 tan r now mu2 into tan i here tan i will be equal to tan i uh, this length Then I will be liquid tan I that is QP uh, divided by uh, Q uh, Q uh, O dex Q TQ or TQ what are OQ oh, so, so, sorry if we uh, let uh, draw this line then tan i will be this distance divided by this distance now this distance is equal to qp and this distance equal to oq so this will be qp or tq by oq similarly tan r will be uh, tan r this is the tan r so tan r if we see this here in this equation tan r will be like uh, QP divided by Q O dash. Uh, then PQ by O dash Q, same thing. Or this imply PQ PQ will cancel out. And so we have O dash bringing this in this side. O dash by Q, uh, OQ will be mu1 by mu2. Or O dash Q is the O dash Q. O dash Q is the apparent uh, uh, apparent uh, depth and O Q is the real uh, real height. Yeah, apparent height here yeah, is written. Not it, it, consider it is a height. Apparent height uh, divided by uh, real height. Yeah, D apparent by D real equals to mu one by mu two. Now because mu one is of uh, greater uh, refractive index so we take mu1 is equal to mu and mu2 is equal to 1 because mu1 is uh, rare or rare so uh, we have d apparent by d real equals to mu or d apparent equals to mu into dr or you can say that uh, uh, 
अपारेंट हाइट इक्वल टू म्यू इन टू अपारेंट रियल हाइट now for several media so for different media d apparent net will be mu1 d1 plus mu2 d2 plus dash 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 mu1 dn equal to sigma i equals to n mu i di and the value of apparent shift is given by that is change in uh, uh, position of the uh, image and object object o q dash will be O dx q minus O q, where d apparent minus d real equals to mu minus one into d real. So for several media, this will be O O uh, O O dx equal to shift total shift net equals to mu one into one into d one plus mu two into one minus mu two minus one into d two plus dash 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 mu n minus one into d n. Where mu one, mu two are the refractive index of medium, equals to sigma i equals to one to n mu i minus one into d i. So now total internal uh, reflection. Total internal reflection. When ray when a light ray passes from denser to the rarer medium it went away from the normal and as the angle of incidence increases the angle of refraction also increases for a particle value of angle of incidence the angle of refraction becomes 90 degree that is uh, the ray grays from the separating layer is grays from the separating layer the the angle of incidence in this situation is known as the critical angle if the ray is incident at the angle of incident greater than the critical angle in this case the ray returns into the same medium the phenomenon is known as the total internal reflection and the Laws of reflection remains valid at in this case. For example, here you see uh, for i greater than c. Uh, here you are see for uh, let this is the first situation when angle of incidence is less than uh, critical angle. Then uh, uh, this is a denser medium and this is the rare medium. Ray is going. to denser to rarer so it went away from the normal now again this angle is increased and it become to equal to critical angle then the ray will pass uh, through the boundary that is parallel to the boundary and uh, and this case is called a uh, critical case and the uh, angle at this point and in this case is the critical angle and uh, if i is uh, angle of incidence is greater than critical angle then uh, ray ray will uh, reflect back to the same medium so this is the case of total internal reflection now from two sin c equals to mu two by mu r This implies c is equal to sine inverse mu two by mu one. For total internal uh, um, reflex reflection, i greater than c. This implies sine i greater than sine c. This implies sine i greater than mu two by mu one, or i greater than sine inverse mu two by mu one. Or if uh, mu one is uh, rare medium, is consider air, and mu two is taken as mu, then. I greater than will be sine inverse mu. 